But before you get into dyes, the dyes, the dyes, the dyes, right. Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Superdrug TV. I'm your host today, Liberty Paul, and we're gonna be getting a closer look at skin and all the right products to use to keep your skin glowing and happy. But before we get into it, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ding, hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss an episode. Coming up today. Hi Superdrug TV, I'm Keeks Reed, a freelance beauty editor, and today I'm gonna to talk you through my go-to looks using the Eco Styler hair products. We hear about the top masks, tips and tricks that you guys need in your life. And we're about to delve a little bit deeper into those skin superchargers and let's find out what they really do. So right now I am like two days away from like a dire need of a wash day. And this is the time where I do tend to do more like hair ups and like play with like slicked back looks and stuff because my hair has a lot of product in it. By this point, I tend to wash my hair maybe every week to 10 days, so yeah. So the first look I'm gonna do is the kind of slick back, like the very classic, like you could be going to the gym, you could be going to like, I don't know, some fancy restaurant in Mayfair. So for that look, I'm gonna go for the Eco Style Olive Oil Formula. So all of the gels give you all day hold, no flaking, no frizz, anti-itch, like they are, just like the cream of the crop and really just, just affordable and easy to get hold of. I love this one, it's got 100% natural olive oil extract in it. So for this, I use a towel comb and then I use like a really like sturdy brush. I also use a detangling brush as well. I'm just gonna try and define that a little bit more. This is the kind of look that I would do if I have genuinely five minutes to go. I'll just brush through. I'm gonna show you how much gel I'm gonna use. This is why this tub will last you for at least 25 years. And then rub it to the tops of my hands and then just place it on the top of my head. Can you see how that's making my hair really, really shiny? And then I just use the L in my finger to smooth and the same for this side. And I'll use this brush again, now that everything's back. So you can either leave the back out like that, which I think can be quite fun, or I wrap, wrap over, and then tuck. And it's like a little neat bun. Now what I will do now is to let the gel set, I'll wrap it with my headscarf. Just like super tight. And then I'll go and make a coffee and finish off the rest of my getting ready routine, which I'm gonna do. And then I'll come back and I'll show you how neat it looks. As you can see, I mean, obviously. <laughs> okay, for look number two, this is like my fun look because I very much used to live in space buns. Um, which essentially are just like two space buns like there. Just two like buns. Kind of like Princess Leia, but I wear them kind of lower down. And then I'm gonna do the tendril trend of the Y2K trend. For this one, I'm going to use the Eco Styler Argan Oil Eco Style Gel. And Argan Oil is amazing for locking in hydration and this one has it in abundance. Also, all of the gels are alcohol free. So for this one, you're gonna do a middle part in all the way down the back of your hair, separate them, separate the two sections, like so. Again, this is a very quick style because we're not about long styles. We're gonna take a triangular piece at the front, like that. We're gonna take our tangle teasing brush. All right, I take a little bit more in for this one because I'm gonna put it down the whole length of my hair. So just like a light glazing of both hands, I'd say for each section. And you want to make sure the front section that you take is like really, really smooth. And then just create a plait at the nape of your neck. Like this. 
Will I push it up? And then take your scrunchie. On. And then I'm going to do the other side. And then now we're going to sort out these tendrils. <laughs> so I use just like a regular straightener, just any straightener will do. And this is my two in one style and pre style. Because when I take these out tomorrow, if I kept them in, which I won't be because I'm going to show you another style. If When I take these out in the morning, if I kept them in, they would have really lovely defined curls. Obviously, before you go to bed, you'd want to also curl the front bit so that you have like two straight bits and then curly bits. But yeah, this time I'm going to use the black castor oil and flaxseed one. You can use this to create definition by doing a basically a braid out. Right, so you take about that much. For this, you would really only need a little bit. And actually, let's put it on this bit of my hair. And then, I don't even know how to describe a braid, guys. You're gonna grab the bit from underneath <laughs> and then just keep taking extra bits going over each section. What I'd do in this instance, where we're doing like half and half, like half out, half, I would tuck it under and use a clip and secure it in place. And you're left with this really cute braid. In fact, who needs to do all of it? Let's just leave it at that. I think that's actually quite cute. Having half in, half out. Thank you so much for watching and make sure you take a look in the link in the description and I'll see you soon. Bye. So now it's time to dive a little bit deeper into those pesky pores and find out more about masks. What do they do and do we really need them? Take a look at this. Hey Superdrug TV, I'm Kristen and I'm a beauty TikToker. Superdrug TV sent me some of their top face masks, so let's get into why do we need them, who should use them, what we should use them for, and any tips and tricks. So there's four things you're going to want to do before you use your sheet mask. One, you're going to want to leave it in the fridge so when you apply it to your face it's very cool and refreshing. Two, you're going to want to have your face cleansed. Uh, and that links me to number three, make sure that your face is dry after you're done cleansing. It just helps you remove any excess makeup and it allows the sheet mask to work even better. And four, you're going to want to do a patch test, a little swab on the side of the cheek just to see you don't have any sort of reaction to it beforehand. Now I'm going to start off with my watermelon sheet mask which is going to hydrate and cool my skin. Okay, there's the cute watermelon face mask. <laughs> Let's get this on. It smells amazing and it does have a really cool chilling effect on my face. It's good to keep the liquid that's like inside the pouch and you can apply it to your neck area and so forth. So this face mask is 10 to 20 minutes long. My skin feels very hydrated. It's important to rub in the sheet mask serum into your face after removing it so it doesn't just stay on the surface of your skin and it really goes in. My skin already feels really hydrated. So I'm using Nip and Fab's Hydrate Lip Mask. This is a Dragon Blood Fix Lip Mask. For 15 minutes, it's meant to soothe and calm the skin, help your lips look more plump and also reduce the look of fine lines. I feel like my lips do look more plump. It looks like more hydrated. I actually added some color to my lips. I don't have any sort of lipstick. I feel like it's really like livened up my lips. I'm gonna use this every time I get ready now. <laughs> Going in with the Garnier Moisture Balm Under Eye Sheets. This is supposed to brighten the under eyes, reduce any dullness, reduce puffiness, and just, you know, hydrate it. So let's, I wanna try it out. This actually feels really soft, like the, the sheet and the moisture, I don't know, it just feels really like soft from even pulling it out. So I've had this on for 15 minutes and I love that it's fragrance free, so it's really good for my sensitive skin. I feel like my under eyes feel more refreshed, energized, lively, and looking good. I'm using the Bare Fruits Flamingo Hair Masking Cap. Uh, I love how this one looks. I know it comes with a flamingo cap, so I'm quite excited to use that. I've dampened my hair already, just so I can apply the hair mask properly. And the hair mask is, I believe, for half an hour. Half an hour, and then I rinse off. Now, when using a hair mask, you're gonna wanna apply it from your ear length and below to avoid like a greasy top. 
Also, you're gonna want to apply it onto dampened hair. So I'm just adding a bit of it straight onto the hair and then I'll work my way through. I love it. <laughs> Got the flamingo cap. So leave this on my hair. <laughs> I love how it looks. So I'll leave it on my hair for about half an hour and then rinse off in the shower. And I'll blow dry my hair actually because when you blow dry it after using a mask it, it comes out beautiful. And that's it everyone. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. You can check out the products linked down below in the description box. And thank you so much Superdrug TV. Bye everyone. Amazing. What about the other skin products? I don't know about you guys but I get pretty confused. What goes where? What is what? Do we really need it? But Superdrug TV has all the answers for you. Hi Superdrug TV, I am Daisy from the YouTube channel Beauty's Big Sister and I'm here today to talk you through some skincare superchargers. Now I'm going to talk you through the products I've got, how you can use them, what they can do for you and why you need them in your life. So firstly, a skincare supercharger is usually a skincare product that concentrates on one amazing ingredient in quite a highly concentrated formula. So it's great if you have particular skin concerns and you can pick the ingredients that you need to really target them. So firstly, we have the Hydration Boost. Now this is the Me Plus Hyaluronic Booster. This has 2% hyaluronic in here, which is incredible. I mean, for me, it's probably the most popular ingredient that people seem to love in their skincare regime because it really is all about adding that hydration. So you can drop this into your moisturizer if you want to or apply it directly onto the skin. So I just like to sweep and then just press it in. So you can work this into your daily skincare routine and you're just gonna apply this onto cleansed dry skin. Now we're gonna go in with the Glow Boost. So this is the Vitamin C Detox Skincare Invigorating Skin Booster. Now for me, Vitamin C is my favorite ingredient ever to have in my skincare regime because this is the gives you the juiciest, dewiest skin ever. Again, it comes with a pipette. Um, so you can just apply it straight into the skin or again you can put this into your moisturizer if you want to as you're applying and this oh, firstly it smells like a dream so it's great at really waking you up it's got this gorgeous invigorating scent but oh, look how juicy my skin looks next we are going to go in with a gentle pill so this is the naturally radiant glycolic overnight pill so sometimes when we can hear pill it can sound a little bit daunting and scary like it's going to be a bit abrasive but this is super gentle and it works overnight i personally use a treatment like this once a week but you can use it up to three times you can see it comes in a clear formulation so it's not like a scrub or anything like that but it does help to gently exfoliate the skin with the glycolic that you've got in this formula. You're gonna sleep in this, wake up in the morning, wash it off, and you're gonna be left with gorgeously radiant skin. Just remember, because of the glycolic in this formulation, make sure, as always, you go in with your SPF the morning after using this product. Now this is your One Swipe Skin Brightener. This is the B by Superdrug Glow Brightening Toner and you have AHA and BHA in this incredible formulation. This is all about brightening and smoothing the skin. If you really want to unclog your pores, reduce the appearance of blemishes and also help with the texture of your skin, then this is the toner that you can use every day in your daily skincare regime. You're just gonna apply this to a skincare pad and swipe it across the skin. Now you're gonna use this after you've cleansed your face and before you go in with any other products like your serums and your moisturizers. Last but not least is the facial tanner. I don't naturally tan my face because I always make sure I have SPF 50 on. So matching up my face shade to my body is super important and the way that I can achieve that is through a product like this. This. this is the Skinny Tan Coconut Water Bronzing Face Mist. I got the Shane Medium and this is infused with vitamin C and hyaluronic, which we know are amazing for really adding the glow and hydration to the skin. So for me, I like to go in 
with a facial mist after my skincare regime. This smells incredible by the way, the coconut scent is pure summer vibes. But you can also put this on over makeup if you want to, it's going to just give you that gorgeous boost of hydration while adding that self tan glow. If you do want to shop any of the products that I have mentioned then all the links will be in the description box below. Thanks so much Superdrug TV for having me and I will see you soon. Bye! I'm learning so much today. And that's it for this week. Thanks for having me guys. It's been so much fun. I've loved it. Don't forget to tune in next week where the amazing YouTuber Lucy Flight will be hosting these episodes for you. It's not one to miss. Lots of love, Lib. Thank <laughs> you.